Webster's third edition defines the word funicular as worked by a rope or the like. That doesn't have anything to do with today's graduation ceremony. I just thought I'd mention it. Get on with it! I see our time is just about up, so I'll cut to the chase. Lumpy, by the powers vested in me by the great state of... Ah! Holy tap dancing tardigrades! It's Cap Mockwabear! Ah, tis I, Cap Mockwabear! In the impervious flesh! Get him, me hearty! What the... Hey! I don't know why you're real, or why you're not microscopically small, or how you learned to speak like a pirate, but I really don't know how to finish this sentence. Hey, I think this giant aqua bear is the same guy that stole Tox's neutron whisker back in Act One. Good eye, Max. And I'll bet these oversized tardigoofs are the ones who've been sabotaging our academy, too. Of course we've been sabotaging your academy, you bill-stucking sons of a mistake bear. I can't have no scuppers scraping freelance police poking around me plundering plans. Can you translate into something less eccentric? The new kid hasn't been put through our advanced criminal <laughs> dialects course yet. I'll do you one better, you scurvy dog. I'll take you with me. Hey, I don't have scurvy. Ah! Prepare to be boarded, big ends. Um. Sam? Sam? Where'd you go, Sam? I have a sudden feeling of overwhelming loss and a lack of someone to rebut my jokes. Don't just stand there, Lumpy! We gotta find Sam! He owes me five bucks. Hey, your bracelet do hickey. It's picking up a signal. He's alive! The signal's weaker than Sam's pickup line. <gasps> we need something like a dowsing rod to find Sam's unique scent. A Sam detector. I got it! Lumpy, pick me up. Now, hold my sniffer over these puddles to find Sam. Hold it. Warmer. Colder. Colder. That's it. Sam's right here in this puddle. Oh, now I get it. Lumpy, use this to suck up that puddle and carry it over to the Meet the Aqua Bears ride. I've got to get some supplies. Be gentle. Sam's in there. What the hell? Welcome, Lumpy! You brought Sam? Oh, can I hold him? Now while I tell Sam the plan, you climb that ladder up to the top of the microscope. Sam? You in there, Sam? <coughs> it's Max. Look, I know we never talk. Okay, that's not it. Maybe we talk too much? All I know is we are coming for you, like a dog chases a rabbit. Or, wait, well, we will see you soon. Bye, Sam. If this works, we'll see you soon. Ah, uh, what? I'll take care of you in our aquarium back in the office. Oh, here we go. Sloppy but acceptable. Now meet me in the DeSoto. It's time to rescue Sam and chew scruffos. And I'm all out of scruffos. What the hell is this? <laughs> Okay, Lumpy, on the count of three, we're headed to the Nanoverse! First, place the car in neutral. Okay, no brakes, please. Now just press this button to hurl us at blazing warp speed! <laughs> just a warning! <laughs> I might pick up those scruffos. Welcome to the Nanoverse, Lumpy! Bet you didn't know that that Meet the Aqua Bears ride actually shrunk people, did you? Are you there? It's Sam! Over your watch! Sam, where are you? Do you need pie? Is anyone there? Come in. We've got to get closer. I'll drive towards that bright light on the horizon. Either Sam's there, or it's the afterlife, and I'm good with either one. There's too many of them! Take my spare gun and shoot down these teeny tinies! This surreal hellscape reminds me of that time I accidentally swallowed a bad papaya and woke up naked in the bathtub of a tostada <gasps> in Toledo. What? Can you still hear me? Captain Mockberry got me tied up to a pirate ship. There's a disco, and my pants are riding up on me. <gasps> oh, you won't believe what this Captain Mockberry loser just told me. Turns out that Mockberry, which is a theme park all those years ago, was thrumming with. 
with all sorts of exotic radiation. When it was placed next to the Meet the Aqua Bears attraction, all that radiation mutated all the aqua bears in that giant aquabarium, giving them big brains and even bigger Napoleon complexes. Ever since the park closed, they've been scavenging the park's equipment, using it to build an enlarging portal. Until now, they've only been able to make a for a few minutes at a time, which explains those weird trench coat guys we've seen lately. Now they've almost got it right. They're about to unleash an army of unkillable giant aqua bears on the city. Hurry! Oh, the nanoscopic world is prettier than I imagined. That was fun! Let's never do it again! What is happening? Well, here we are! At a nightclub! In the Nanoverse! Yeah, that tracks! Max, you need to get in here! Billions of giant aqua bears from the Nanoverse are about to invade the Earth! And I've got a foot cramp! Keep your pants on, Sam! I've got this! Lumpy, we need a way into this anomalous discotheque! If only there were some way we could blend in! Hmm... <coughs> Excuse me! Hello? What the hell? Oh, <laughs> the costume. Oh my god, no. Uh. You're wearing it. Nice one! We can use it as a costume! Sneak our way into Captain Aqua Bear's party and blow up whatever he's up to! Just give me the Aqua Bear skin and let me get up on your shoulders! Head over to that bouncer there and let me do all the talking. <laughs> just you. Eh, just cut to the front of the line. These aqua bears are clueless. Hey, Pally, let's get this party started. Anybody can dance, eh? Uh, what the who now? Hit it, Jack King loser. I think we missed something. Aqua bears communicate by mimicking, Max. Watch what they do and duplicate it. Aqua bears can't disco enough. Papa, good dogs, Echo. <laughs> Try it this way, friendo. Oh, just that. Okay. Look, it's Sam. Welcome to the party, pal. You've been waiting over thirty years to say that, haven't you? Maybe, but that's not important. Captain Aqua Bear's almost finished building his portal. Ah! And that would be bad because... Because it'll permanently enlarge the cabin and all his angry Aqua Bear friends. Yeah, but how many of those can there be? <laughs> 10, 20? Try 8 billion. That is more than 20. You and the kid need to find a way to temporarily knock out all these Aqua Bears and blow up the portal. What about rescuing you? Lumpy's hopeless with straight lines. If it's not too much trouble. Okay, Lumpy. Let's mingle! <laughs> Ever since that dark and glorious day, when that wretched moon rock cursed us with the unwanted booty of intelligence, we Aquabars have been adrift in the lonely seas of the Nanoverse, scraping away in a pitiful, pointless existence. Ooh, that looks tasty! Hold it up to my gaping maw! Meanwhile, mm. open the world. A drop of Dr. Dill's soda. Those toxy humans have been living high off the hole. Oh my god, the soda is all over that thing. Curious details to remember. How are we doing with that infernal portal contraption, Boats and Kevin? Just enter. Any minute now, Captain. Alrighty then. Everybody, um, enjoy the party. And get ready for our voyage! Uh, yar, and so forth. Sam? I've got a planet to take over. Is that Max's distinctive funk I smell? I wonder if I need like a teleportation locomotion to just go up the stairs. Okay, that works. Pretty stupid design wise, but we'll go with it. collection yeah well you try scavenging for fat grooves in an abandoned amusement park when you can only walk around for five minutes at a time here we have some handles pull for foam and for something hmm. that was a lot less foamy than i expected you have to insert one of these soap bottles in first my man what's this it's a party foam container just plug it into the foam cannon and let her rip 
sure what you're trying to do, but I love putting things in other things. Oh, okay. Look out below! I hope you know what you're doing, Luppy. Fingers crossed. Whatever you're trying to do, it's not working. We need to alter the ingredients of these foam containers somehow. Say, I wonder what these floating globbies are. I think that foam container's already got plenty of water, but hey, not... Bold in the hole! I hope you know what you're doing, Luppy. Fingers crossed! Whatever you're trying to do, it's not working. Would I need, like, a specific taste or something? Green? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it's arugula! <laughs> Are you trying to kill him, kid? <laughs> Ooh, yum, scrumpos! You know, I seem to remember you eating a bag of scrumpos when our pet aqua bears mysteriously went into hibernation back in Odd Nine. You know, you pay way too much attention to my diet, Sam. Putting Dr. Dills in the foam? <laughs> Freaky! Say hello to the foam and brain! I hope you know what you're doing, Luffy. Fingers crossed! Whatever you're trying to do, it's not working. Putting Dr. Scrumpos in dance foam? Weird. I think the kid... The combination of Scrumpos and Dr. Dills you've snuck into the Aqua Bear's dance foam is interacting with their metabolisms in some way. Psychedelic! They're still not hibernating, Sam. We need to trigger their metabolic reaction with an energy wave. Maybe a specific sonic burst of some sort. Now you're just making things up. Hey, pal! Can you put this into the mix? That old thing? Are you serious? The crew ain't gonna like this. It was playing when me and my girlfriend met. Or maybe it was my boyfriend. It's so hard to tell with us, am I right? It was playing when all of us met. And then kept playing. For 20 years. Come on! Ugh, fine. Say, what is happening? Oh, huh? in our party hole. And here I thought we were just trying random stuff out until something cool happened. Six a tomato, half a dozen a tomato. Now get me out of these bonds and let's blow up this portal. I'll get the car! Good to see you face to face again, kid. Now how about undoing these clamps so we can blow this thing up and go home? Do you have keys? Thanks, Junior. Those things were giving me a bad case of croquet elbow. Let's head over to the portal thingamabob and figure out the best way to break it. Cat Aqua Bear must be using its mini fusion reactor to power his enlarging portal. Lucky for us, it's also a bomb. Let me just pull out my manual and let's see if we can get this thing to explode before the Aqua Bears wake up. Now just pick up Dill's head so we can arm it. I can this. He looks to the right when he's telling the truth. Oh, me. Right, he said. Oh, me. Squeeze me. Oh, me. Squeeze me. His eyes will turn red when he's telling the truth. Squeeze me. Plunge me. He's telling the truth when his eyes are green. Poke me. Plunge me. Yank me. Poke me. Plunge me. Squeeze me. Poke me. Poke me. Plunge me. He looks up when he's telling the truth. Plunge me. Poke me. Smack me. Squeeze me. Plunge me. Yank me. Squeeze me. Yank me. Squeeze me. Poke me. Poke me. 
That's it. The bomb will go off in... What's that say? The bomb will go off in 30 seconds. Yikes! Now put Dills back in the portal. Thank you, Freelance Police, for putting an end to the abomination I created. Um, you're welcome? I foolishly played God with the microscopic world and put everything I loved in risk. Hey, it happens. Tell my story. Not a chance. Get out of the way! I don't know how to drive! Oh, hi. Sam! Who are you talking to? Max! Took you long enough. Let's go, kid. When I was a child, I always knew I was oh. destined for me. Go, Max. Bye. Hang on, everybody. I can smell infinity, Sam. Hey.